Yo, what's up guys? My name is Summer Hain and these are my 10 wavy essentials. Firstly, on the list of essentials, I have water as my first essential. Everyone has to have H2O. It's good for your body, it's good for hydration, and also, it's good for your skin. Come on, skincare is important. I don't want anyone in this world walking around with bad breath. If you're not brushing your teeth properly, hey, you gotta have gum. I always have gum, no matter where I am, whether I'm gonna go out, whether I'm having lunch, whether I am simply going to the club, gum is essential. Then, <laughs> my third essential are my glasses. I'm actually really blind, but you'll never catch me wearing these. Or maybe you will now. And I need to wear these 24 seven. Oh wow, I can actually see you guys. I cannot believe my eyes. That's crazy. My fourth essential would have to be jewelry. Jewelry is actually a very important thing in my life. My favorite necklace at the moment are butterflies. So anything with a butterfly on it, I have to have it. Um, another essential is my bracelet. It has an initial on of my favorite person in the world. So jewelry is essential. Then my fifth essential, lip gloss, because you gotta keep your lips glowing. My girls watching this, you know the vibe. So lip gloss is definitely an essential. My lips are gonna go from this to extra shiny period city girls period pool then my sixth essential pepper spray you all know that we live in south africa and it is not a safe world it's not a safe country if i do say so i think we all know that pepper spray is definitely an essential guys if it's not pepper spray it is some form of self-defense whether it is a knuckle buster whether you carry that glock on you you need to have some form of self-defense at least i do that's all i know i need some form of self-defense my seventh essential perfume or deodorant anything guys come on you gotta smell good it doesn't have to be the most expensive perfume in the world but deodorant perfume whichever is gonna make you smell like you are a million dollars my eighth essential no matter where i am no matter what i'm doing i'm going to get hungry at some point Okay, so if you didn't know that about me, I like to eat. So I always have a snack. It might not be this bar necessarily, but I'll always have a snack. Whether it is biltong, whether it is sweet, whether it is a chocolate, even a packet of chips. I'm gonna eat it. Ah! I'm gonna have a snack with me. But another essential is definitely my phone. Guys, I don't think I can go without my phone. It's actually so bad. I am a Gen Z and I cannot go out without my phone. Wow, life would be a disaster. Imagine not having TikTok. Imagine not being able to watch Wavy Terry on my phone. That's my dog show. There's my dog. There's my dog show. So, my last essential definitely has to be a hoodie. I can't go anywhere without having these. Either in my car, either in my bag, but it has to be close to me. It's either the black one or the white one. You know, diversity is real. That's about it. I think that's 10. Yeah, solidly 10. I can't go anywhere without these hoodies. Shout out to KIC for these dope ass hoodies. There's no free bro. <laughs> she said she loved me for my jeans. A rock star living while I'm popping on the beat. Every shot he on the side, really trying to be my queen. Smoking over candy, nigga, really fucking with the green. Baby, baby, yes, sir. So now it's time for the wavy QA. Summer, are you ready? I was never ready. So Summer, first question. What's your stance on male best friends? Okay, it's possible. It's possible if it's really platonic. You can do it. You can be best friends and it can be platonic. But I do know Hans that use it as like a way to kind of just fuck another guy. We don't hey, what we is? For lifer. <laughs> it's all up to the girl though. Because if she wants this guy, She's gonna tell you that's my male best friend, but she's also Loki gonna be fucking him. A shoulder to cry on is a <laughs> dick to ride on. <laughs> that's yeah. crazy. That's, that's a crazy statement. Yeah. What was your first viral moment? My first viral moment yeah. was when EB pranked me. And I oh, I remember him. that. Yeah, he pranked so me funny. by telling me that he likes me and I thought that we were friends and I just wanted to keep it platonic and yeah, I don't know if it was real or not, Oof. but apparently it was a prank Oof. and then it came out on YouTube as a prank. Yeah. And I cried because I was like, I remember I you cried. Like, you just took advantage of me. Yeah, I started pouring out my whole 
life experience to him yeah, yeah, on yeah. camera. So there was another situation where a guy was pretending to be your best friend? Is that what you're saying? Yes, yes. And he just wanted to smash? Yes. So it was like PTSD. Oh, I see. That's yeah. why you cried. Definitely. I'm damaged. <laughs> why? Just Are you crying? <laughs> Give me a hug, bro. Don't cry, man. It's not even funny anymore, honestly. Oh, if that was a prank, it's not funny. I was wondering, why was it so deep? It was very deep. I was like, oh, this always happens to me. Like, no one actually wants to be my real friend. They're just trying to smash or they're just trying to get with me. It's very okay. common. It's an evil world we live in. But hey, I'm gonna keep living. So obviously you get a lot of DMs, right? Yeah. <laughs> like on a daily basis, maybe like, give me a number. If I post something, the numbers go up there. Eh? For sure. <laughs> <laughs> it's like 20, 50. Wow, man. Uh... For sure. Yeah, it goes crazy. How do you slide in the DM? Well, I've never slid into someone's DMs, but if I had to. What's the best thing you've seen there? You like three posts. Okay, any three posts. You don't even have to look at them. You don't have to comment, nothing. You just like three posts. There's also this thing where you can like the story now. That's also apparently like a- That's a cheat story. code. Just slide up on a, on a random IG story and just like comment something that has nothing to do with the photo. Okay. So that you can create a conversation. It's not about, oh, you're so hot, I have the hearts for you. Create a conversation. Yo guys, it's been a wavy Q&A. We're here with Summer. Please don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. You can find Summer at- Summer Haynes underscore. YouTube, Instagram, TikTok. Yeah. Yeah. Don't yeah. go to my Facebook. My mom. What's just, on your Facebook? That's a good question. My mom just posts a whole bunch of embarrassing stuff there of me. It's not. It's not a safe space. Thanks mm -hmm. for having me, guys. Ten essentials with Wavy Theory.